Temperatures this morning are in the lower 60s. We're at 63 degrees in Lafayette. Skies have turned mostly cloudy. Winds are out of the west northwest at 3 miles per hour, dropped to 60 in Rochester, Peru, and currently in the lower to mid 60s across the viewing area. We already have scattered showers and thunderstorms moving into our western counties this morning, and they are tracking south and east. But through the morning hours, we have a warm front that's going to lift north, and that's going to help make the rain showers more widespread throughout the viewing area. Looking at Precision 18 radar, scattered rain showers falling in the southern half of Newton County, also southern Jasper County, just south of Rensselaer, and then widespread rain falling throughout Benton County, through Fowler, Oxford, also southwestern White County. Still staying dry in Monticello, but we also have rain showers moving into northwestern Tippecanoe County, and then a couple thunderstorms, a couple cells within Warren County. Through the afternoon hours, we We'll eventually see this first round of rainfall move out, but then we have a second round that we're monitoring, and that is when we'll have a better chance of seeing severe weather. Don't want to rule out the possibility of perhaps an isolated strong to severe thunderstorm with this first round we'll see this morning, but it's the round we're going to see in the evening where we will have a better chance for severe weather. There's a moderate risk for severe weather in the northeastern half of the viewing area, and then our southwestern counties are under an enhanced risk. We should see a brief break from the rain showers and storms through the late afternoon hours and into the first part of the evening. But after 10 o'clock, that is when that next round of storms will begin to move in. The primary threat will be damaging straight line winds. Large hail cannot be ruled out. There will also be the potential for isolated tornadoes and then heavy downpours within this system. We'll time, out it, time it out with our future cast starting this morning at 7 o'clock, dealing with scattered showers and thunderstorms in our southwestern counties. It's going to continue to push north and east, that boundary on, as a whole, and then we'll still have scattered showers and thunderstorms through the lunch hour, going to move out by 3 o'clock this afternoon. That is when we're going to see that brief break from the showers and storms. We'll still be left with mostly cloudy skies through the late afternoon and into the first part of the evening. But that next round is going to move in after 10 o'clock into our northwestern counties. Scattered showers and thunderstorms, and this is when we'll have the best chance of seeing that strong to severe thunderstorm with a line that's going to be pushing through the viewing area around midnight tonight. And then we'll still be left with those storm chances through 4 o'clock in the morning, finally beginning to move out after. 5 a.m. and we should be left with possibly a stray shower for early Thursday morning. Afternoon high temperatures today in the mid to upper 80s, lower 80s to our north. We'll reach 84 in Lafayette, falling into the upper 60s and lower 70s for tonight. And then tomorrow high of 83, stray morning shower. Then we'll be left with decreasing cloud cover for the rest of the day with quieter weather conditions for Thursday. And then we'll have mostly sunny skies returning Friday and Saturday. Saturday of this week. Temperatures are also going to continue to rise into the upper 80s Saturday and Sunday. Another chance for thunderstorms on Sunday and it's a Monday high of 87 degrees. Okay, we're going to check in with you again in a few minutes.